G'day, my name's Kai and I study physiology at the University of Otago. Originally, I'm from the Netherlands, but a few years ago, I decided to come to the Neden to study um, for my postgraduate degree. And what convinced me to do this was the combination of learning from top-notch academics and living in a place with a pretty unique student culture. So physiology is the study of how the human body works. So the more you learn about this topic, the better you understand yourself. So if you want to study the human body and have a good time while doing so, Otago is the place to be. Have you ever wondered um, how our body works? Have you wondered how the mechanisms of life function? Well, then physiology is for you. We study how our body works from cellular mechanisms, how cells communicate, this is one of our expertise, down to how the heart beats, how the heart works, and my expertise is how the brain works. So we have these three extremes, and if you ever wondered why we actually are able to wake up before the alarm clock rings, maybe less you so, but your parents might do so, well, we have actually a clock in our brain, and um, this would be interesting if you want to study neuroscience, for example, because then you would understand how this clock actually works. Another thing is if you watch smart um, phones in the evening, you are exposed to blue light or your computer screen when you study, for example, then <clears throat> this is actually detrimental because that would interrupt your clock in the brain and you would get obesity and diabetes later on maybe and cognitive decline. So if you want to understand all these big pictures, how systems in our body interact with the big picture and your later on life and also longevity, how long you will live, then physiology might be an interesting subject for you. Well, entry qualifications or um, first year subjects would be human body systems too. So you need to, um, you need to select two papers out of human body systems and then you can choose from chemistry, physics, cells and biochemistry. You need to choose papers out of those. Why would you study at Otago? Well, we are in a unique position in the world and um, we have a campus, so not like other universities in New Zealand. And you would have an amazing life down at Otago, I can tell you, and we are a very international university, so you have um, a very great cultural input and um, that would be unique to Otago in this combination, for example. Also, we have world-class facility in our facilities in our um, department and in the university. You can work with confocal, laser, scan microscopes, or you can even work with atomic force microscopes. If you want to understand what they are, study physiology. <laughs> um, what can you do when you study physiology? This is a, an interesting question. So what are our career paths? Well, you can become a lecturer or a professor, the career path that I chose because I'm really interested in the subject and we stimulate um, the interest of many students because it's such a basic science and it's so important to know how our body actually functions. And if you're really interested in the subject, then you have a good chance to become actually a professor, for example. But more important is that we learn um, to understand scientific literature. So we need to have our own ideas and build our own ideas and to fight an argument based on scientific reading and understanding the scientific context so to make an informed decision. And this would be really important for, for future jobs that you seek because yeah, that, that is something people look for. You could also work in um, for example, um, IT things that are related to physiology or you could do medical research. You can work in universities, you can work in private institutions, crown institutions for example, private industry, 